Welcome back to the JSFL. We're here in season two, a brand new whole season with Thursday night football. And it's the defending champions, the Phoenix Steel Monsters hosting the new team, Atlanta Predators. They are relocated from Miami to Atlanta. And we get to see the new team against the returning champions. We're going to be here in Phoenix tonight. I'm coming to Joshua Hexel, and we will get this one away in just a few moments. The defending champs, a little lineup change, rookies, few losses like Frank Jog in the trade, but a few ads on as well. So, and Miami, a lot of changes. Or I just, my bad, Atlanta, a lot of changes. New QB, and they took in the fir first pick of the draft. Heisman winner Trent Hudson. A little bit of change on the um, defensive side. No change in the receiver core, but a new franchise back. They hope in Ward Rock are taking the fifth round. Against Brian Tepps, his second year now in the league. He led his team to a championship, and he also had rookie of the year last year. Against so uh, maybe a rookie of the year for, for this year against last year's rookie. And let's see how that pans out. But we're already here in Phoenix. Kickoff just coming your way. And we're moments away from kickoff here in Phoenix. So now the kickoff, it will go to Atlanta first. They will start the first drive of this new season in the JSFL. So this one taken out to the 21. We get to see Heisman winner, number one pick, Trent Hudson on the field. So here it comes out, no stats yet. Again, as last season, the stats on the board are not going to be correct. So Hudson coming out here. See what he can do in Atlanta. Well, Phoenix right now, this is going to be a hard challenge on the first night. Thursday night in the rookie. So here's a throw. Going to get out to the 22. Call Franklin on that catch. Well, let's look at this offense. Offensive line, all the same size. Right tackle, Tony Bronze. They added that rookie. Call Franklin, William Huffman, Warren Rocker, Eric Shady, and Joseph Carousel on your receivers, backs, and tight end. So, William Huffman taken in the seventh round, and Warren Rocker taken in the fifth. Rocker going to be the starter for the halfback tonight. And just in case, I was converted back to wide receiver as well. Second and after the two yard pickup. Here's Warren Rocker, his first carry of the night in his career. He's going to go back a yard. Welcome to the league by Julio Odom. So, it's a little welcome gift for him, too. He gets his first tackle on his career. Rookie on rookie on that play. Odom got out of the way of his blocker and he met to rocker on that one. And it's third down and nine for the Predators, so early struggles here. Let's see if they can convert. Third and nine. Here's Hudson. Screen. This one going to be blown up at the line. Nowhere on that play, and Rocker is stuffed. Jordan Jackson on that play, and the Phoenix Gale Monsters get a three and out on the new team Atlanta Predators. So now the punt team coming on for Atlanta's Phoenix will get their first offensive drive of the year. So this punt is going to be off. And it'll be taken in at the 17. See how he gets this one. Little juke move there. Can't juke the next one. That was Julio Joke on the return to the 39. He's going to be their franchise back this year. He can't split carries with Jog anymore. It's going to be mostly jokes. But they did draft Sam Hart. But here's Brian Taps. He's coming out. Rookie of the year last year. And this year, going to be looking for that MVP. And a Super Bowl champs MVP. 
Wow. So yeah, Sam Hart was kind of the Frank Jog replacement maybe they're looking for. First and ten. Here is Peps. Going incomplete. Jet Wood can't get his hands on it. Let's look at this Phoenix offense. Offensive line, no new guys besides Hump. Oh no, a couple new guys. Left guard and right guard. Shven Ja and Humphrey Charles. Sam Hart, the rookie receiver, and Esteban Sylvester is the rookie years. Sam Hart, the rookie running back, he's going to be playing backup. And Esteban Sylvester is taking the number two slot. And no, Hank Loop moving up to number one. So a lot of rookies on this Phoenix offense. Second and ten. With the motion, Taps now. Taps stepping up, Taps moving with his legs to the 44. Five yard pickup. Atlanta's new defense. D line, all the same besides Matthew Harmon out of free agency. They got Toby Trey and Josh Hexel for the linebacking core now. So rookies mostly have that linebacking core. And Israel Ryans at corner and Sandover in free agency. So then Adam Carson and Josh Carl will still make up your safety duo. So here's third and five for Phoenix. They don't want to go three and out as well. So here's Taps third down. Throwing this one caught. Nice catch there to the 47. And that's a first down Phoenix. Hank Wolf, his first catch of the early season. That goes for nine yards. And Andy Sandal is going to be on him tonight. First down, Phoenix, they convert on third and five. And see what they do now on first down. Slow team to carry out a joke, so I wonder when they'll use him. First down, motion. It's going to be a jet fake. And he's going to go backwards. Jokes, negative one yards on his first carry, stuffed at the line by Tony Space. Corner now, he was first string last year, now he's third string. But he gets a nice tackle there to start off his season. Stuffed the hole. And the nice, in the corner again, the nice tackle on the running back in open space. And it's second down now. Second and 11. At the 48, seven minutes left to go in the first quarter. Here's second and 11. Jokes running up the middle, moving around. He's staying up, and he gets a two with a 42. Hard worker there on that carry, and he gets him four yards. Tony Space on that one. And it's third and six after the great carry by Jokes, which only went for four yards. And they're going five wide here on third down. Taps, Wade. Threads the needle to Hank Woop, and that's a touchdown, Phoenix. Hank Woop, 42 yards. The fly route works to perfection for Phoenix. Safety couldn't get him, and that was Adam Carson's job right there. He got off Sandoval, and Carson was supposed to be the backup man, and Carson got burnt. There's Hudson. His first game not going so far as planned. Ben Wettis and Coach are having a little bit of a chat over there. And for the extra point now for Phoenix. It's up and it is right through. That drive was 6 plays, 60 yards in 2 minutes and 10 seconds. Leads to a Phoenix touchdown. Now Trent Hudson, the rookie, going to have to try to lead his team to a better than 3 and out drive this time. They don't want to have to relocate again. Well, it's not even in the question yet. Yeah, I don't know why I bring that up. Still plenty of season to go through. Well, in the first game of many games this season.
All right, kickoff is away, and Atlanta will get it right back. Taking out from their own end zone, see what he can do with this kick. And it's going to go to the 21. So Franklin, not much happening on that one, but he gets it to the 21. So not the worst thing in the world. And now comes on Atlanta's offense, and we'll see what they can do. Last time, three and out under the rookie backfield they have, which is consists of Trent Hudson and Warren Rockman and William Huffman. And here's first down and 10. Here's a throw outside. Franklin, he's going to get stuffed up. Colin Franklin, nowhere to go on that one. Last year's defensive back of the year, Byron Baxter on the tackle. Here's second and 13. Here's Rocker. Warren Rocker powered up to the 23. And that run a little better than last time. He gets six on it. And it's third down again for Atlanta. Third and seven. Did Phoenix get two three and outs in a row? Or will Atlanta finally get a little burst of energy? So third down, Trent Hudson. Hudson stepping away. Hudson picking up the first down and a lot more. Hudson making a move. Hudson falling down to the 49 in his first rush. And the career is 26 yards and 8 yards after the contact. That is your Heisman winner. And first overall pick and what a great carry to start off his career. Nice pickup on first to get a first down on third down. He had room to run. They must have played playing really good coverage, but they haven't seen him. And now it's first down for the Atlanta Predators after Hudson's nice move outside. Here's Hudson. Hudson moving away again. Hudson out of the pressure. Had Amigo in his face, but gets out of it. And Amigo being a great pass rusher. Past his prime though, but. Still great, nonetheless. Hudson escapes right up the middle. Nice moves. I guess Miami slash Atlanta, because last year this franchise, not, well, they, when they were Miami, had Warren Jones. He was a nice scrambler. Now they have Hudson. First and ten. Here's Hudson. Throwing. That's on the slant. Caught. Calling Franklin down to the 29. Atlanta's moving the ball pretty nicely now. He has two catches, 14 yards so far. Baxter, his second tackle. He'll mostly be on Franklin tonight. Here's first down and 10. Hudson. Going this one to Eric Shady gets it to the 23. Hudson four for four to start his game in his rookie debut, and Shady with a nice catch there for six yards. Rocker in the backfield on this play. One receiver up top, bunch set. Second and four, here's Rocker. He's going to get to carry. He's going to try to bounce it outside, but he's going to get hit behind the line. It's third down and five. I want Daryl shot coming off the edge. He gets the tackle for a loss. After that play, another third down for Atlanta. If they can convert this one, it'd be nice. They want to get to the end zone. Third and five. Here's a run. Rocker can't make the distance. I don't know if I would have called that call right there. But it's fourth down. A nice stop there by Phoenix. Collapsing right at the seams. He almost should, he broke off one tackle, but after that, everyone around him. 
Gordon Jackson the one to bring him down at the end. And it's fourth down and five, and it's Atlanta's field goal team probably going to come on now. Yes, it will. This one will be a 40-yard attempt, so manageable by all means. The kick up, it is good, right through the uprights. And it's 3-7 to seven here on Thursday Night Football in Phoenix. So the Predators with a nice three points there, but that's not what they want. They want a lot more of that. They wanted the big six and extra point on top. But four-point game, pretty interesting here in the first quarter. We'll see what Phoenix can do on their second drive. The kick away, and Phoenix will get it next. This one taken in from their own end zone. Going to take it out. Coming up the middle, and that's a nice return to the 38. Julio joked with that return, and that was a great one. 38 yards in the turn. And here comes out Brian Tepps. Touchdown on his last drive. And he's looking to take his team back to the playoffs and for another championship. So, it's going to be a nice start beating the Predators. So, first and 10. Run up the middle, it's jokes. He's going to get two yards, and that's it on the carry. Tristan Enzone on the tackle. And it's second down and eight after the two yard pickup by Jones. Your second and eight. Harry Jokes. Jokes finding room. Get it to the 49, and that's the first down, Phoenix. He's averaging 3.7 yards a carry, and he's stand up on the tackle. Nice opening there made by Phoenix, and Lobez thinks that that's got to be the two guards, the new rookies. They helped out a lot in that play. So here's first down and ten. A little over a minute, a little less than a minute. Here's Teps throwing as he's hit. Jokes out of the backfield. Jokes breaks a tackle to the 34. And nice play there by Teps getting it off before hit. Jokes picks up a first down for Phoenix. And Teps got, would have got sacked right there, but he gets out of it and makes a good throw to Jokes. There's only the backup, but it went for quite a few yards. So here's first and ten. Tefs. Tefs throwing out of the backfield again. He's got. I don't even know who that player is. But he didn't catch it, so it's not important. Five rush, five pass so far from Phoenix's offense. Let's see what they do on second down and ten. Steps on second down, throwing, threads the needle to that one, and that's Chet Wood. Led in touchdowns last year along with receivers and tight ends, and he also led in receptions among the whole league. His first catch of the season is going to go for 13 yards is Teps. You see his passing game's kind of improved. He threads the needle perfectly on that one. Four seconds left if they don't have to run a play. And they won't, and that's the first quarter. Phoenix is winning here in their home opener against the Atlanta Predators. It's Atlanta Predators 3, Phoenix Steel Monsters 7. Here's first down and 10 for Teps and the offense. Teps going to do a delayed handoff and jokes it right in his tracks. That was Peyton Wettis and Joshua Hexel, the rookie. Oh no, my bad, that was Dan Marino. 
It was Payne Wettis and Dan Marino, my bad. Here's second and 12, about to go. Tackle for a loss on Jokes. Steps another hand off, Jokes to the outside. Jokes trying to break some room. He only gets a yard on that carry. Nice pursuit by Atlanta, stopping him right at the line or a little in front of it. And it's third and long now, third and 11 for Phoenix. So here is Teps on third down. We'll see what they can do here. Got to get, get a little creative. Two backs in the backfield. Teps throwing it. Oh, pressure going to make it incomplete. As Teps was looking for the halfback screen. And I think that would have developed pretty nicely. But it's going to be incomplete as Atlanta got the pressure. I mean, the pressure. This one's going to be 39 yards. One less yard than what Atlanta was. The kick is going to go up. It's going to go right through the uprights. And it's going to be 3-10. to 10. It's going to make it a touchdown game. Touchdown with time now. And Atlanta will get the ball and see what they can do to come back to that three point. Now, Franklin will be on the return, and we'll see what Atlanta can do on the kickoff, or if they have do get the kickoff. Kickoff away, he's going to take it in from his own end zone. Take it out, he's going to get to the 20. Time. And 21 yards per turn for Colin Franklin, and Trent Hudson's offense will get back out here. Here is first and ten. Another run. It's Rocker. Rocker. A little power there. He gets it to the 23, and that's three yards. Second and seven. Jordan Jackson was on the tackle. A little switching formation by Atlanta. Phoenix tries to adjust. Second and seven. Oh, fake. Carl Franklin down to the 26. And I think it would have been better if they actually took that handoff. There's open room to run for Rocker. Carlos Young, the add-on in free agency, gets the tackle there. Here's third and four. Hudson looking to throw. Hudson, scrambling, throwing, incomplete, throws it away. That's his first incompletion of his career. Hudson didn't, guess didn't have anyone open, and he decides to throw it away instead of taking the sack. And now it's fourth down for Atlanta. Fourth and four. I don't think they'll go for this. Most likely a punt team. And yes, it is. Punt team comes on. We'll see if Atlanta can pin this one, pin them deep. The punts are the way. This one gonna be taken in from the twenty. Gonna take it up the middle. Jelly top attack to the thirty-six. And Atlanta starts in pretty good field position. Buffman, the rookie, ran into them that time. Only a joke today, he's six rushes and 14 yards. It's not been the great for him. Still plenty of time, though, to get started and get the Jets rolling. Three receivers in the bunch. First and ten. Sets. His blitz heavy. He finds the open man. It's Chet Wood. Chet Wood down to the 41, and that's a Phoenix Gilmore's so first down. Atlanta threw the blitz on Teps, and... He had blocked, so he just sent it downfield where Chet would be proud of. 
Great blocking there by Phoenix, making sure Atlanta couldn't send the extra man in. First down and 10. Here's Teps. Teps stepping back. Teps stepping to the side. Teps is going to take off. Brian Teps with the juke move. He's going to get hit at the 34 and dropped. Second and four now. Dan Marino, his first tackle of the season. It's second and four. Second and four. They're going four receivers in the back. No tight end. Well, let's just point out slot. Taps throwing. Oh, could have been intercepted, but it's deflected. Third down. Third and four. That one could have been intercepted. Got the deflection, so brings up the third down. Third and four. Here's a run. Julio Jokes breaks open. And that one goes for Phoenix Skill Muscles. First down. Seven carries, 24 yards for Jokes today. Averaging over a little over three yards a carry. First and ten for Phoenix. Steps, hand off to Jokes up the middle. Jokes plowing down to the 18 yard line. Second and three now to the seven yard power run by Jokes. Second and three now. Here's Taps. Throwing here's Jokes out of the back. But Jokes with the spin move. Gets it only to the line of scrimmage after the great moves. And it's third down four. Taps got to huddle the troops here and figure out what to call here on third down. Nice juke move by Tap. I mean, Jokes, but I don't go for much. That's a jump over by end zone. I see he hurdled a Phoenix lineman, I believe that was, or maybe it was a receiver to get to jokes on that play. 10 rush, 10 pass. Phoenix has kept the ball pretty well spread. Two to do here on third down. It's a run with jokes. Jokes. Oh. Jokes making a move, and he gets it open space, and that's a first thing goal to the eight yard line. Nine carries, 40 yards for Jokes. Added to 4.4 yards carry. And that's a great carry that kind of stings Atlanta there. Josh Carls, his first tackle. Josh Carls had to go all the way from the other side of the field to make that tackle. So first and goal, can Phoenix cash this one in? To put them up by two scores, here's Jokes up the middle. Jokes gets tackled in open space. Well, that's Sam Hart, the rookie, with the first carry of his career, and goes for five yards. Second and goal now. So second and goal, I formation. Run up the middle, this one, touchdown, Phoenix. The Gila Monsters get it in. First rushing touchdown of his career for Sam Hart. The rookie cashes it in for Phoenix. The dive. Great blocking there by Phoenix. Wood even had the next block for him, so he could have went a lot farther. That one's going to put him up by two touchdowns with this extra point. 
to kick up, and it is good. I play 65 yards, 3 minutes, 48 seconds on a good drive by Phoenix. He rushes 8 yards on that drive for Sam Hart. He scored it in. Here, the kick away in Atlanta. Get it back. Take it in from the own end zone this time. They're going to kneel it and take it up to 25. Smart move. So, Atlanta down by 14. And not time to panic yet, but you don't want them to get too far away from you. So, I'm thinking. Gotta maybe take a little more chances. I haven't seen anything so deep yet from Atlanta. Maybe try something deeper, but I know how good Phoenix secondary is. But here's Rocker. Rocker getting stumbled on his own. Man, he's going to fall down. Averaging 0 0.5 yards of carry. Julio Odom, his third tackle of the game. His second tackle for a loss. And a second and 14 after Rocker can't get anything done with that one. Second and 14 for Atlanta. Here's Hudson stepping up. Going as he's hit. That one caught. First down as the speed gets him there. That one was Rocker. His two catches on 17 yards. Offered forward with the tackle. Hudson threw as he was hit. And a nice little back behind catch by Rocker. He had enough room to run, dude. First and ten now for Atlanta at the 40 yard line. Hudson throwing hits his offensive of line and that one's going down. Second and ten. Second and ten now. He's a run. He's gonna get stopped right at the line behind the line. Actually, Rocker not his day. Not a great debut at all. Seven carries, negative one yards. The third and fourteen. Not the defense you want to face right away on your debut. Third and 14. Let's see what Atlanta calls here. Big play. Hudson. Hudson gets away from this rush. Hudson. First down. Hudson makes him a fumble. And Atlanta's got it. Taking it the other way. He might just go all the way. Makes a move to the 30. Denzel Crazy, the rookie on the recovery. And the Phoenix Young Monsters have it at the 30. Great run turns into a fumble. Eel monsters take over. That's got to stay. So first and ten for Phoenix Eel monsters at the thirty. They're up by fourteen. Another touchdown be great. A little jet sweep. Here's Chet Wood. Chet Wood get it to the twenty-six. 
And the two-minute warning here, it's 3-17, to 17, and Atlanta Predators down by 14. This is the defending champs, Phoenix Field Monsters. Second and six, here's Taps. Throw, and that was deflected off the throw. Great play there by Atlanta in the third down. And they might have to settle for three if they cannot get this conversion here. Here's third down. That's a low snap, giving it to Jokes, and he doesn't get anywhere. Not that the line is fourth down, though. I don't get why Phoenix is going so many runs on third downs. Not getting them too many places. I know you want to include the run game, but I don't know if that's the place to do it. Third down. This kick is going to be a 42-yarder. Pick up, it is going to make it. That's good. So it's 17-point game now, as Phoenix is extending their lead by quite a bit. Kick is going to be away, and Atlanta will get it right back after the fumble. Still two minutes, so they have signed to get a touchdown here. And this return is going to be out to the 17, not really that well by Colin Franklin on the return to them. So Hudson, after his fumble, he's had some pretty nice rushes, but that fumble was not the way to end that last drive. And the first down for the Predators at 17. 145 left to go in this first half. Here's a run. Rocker stuffed right at the beginning. He has negative four yards on his eight rushes today. I think they need to try to get into the outside more. Inside has not been working. Dwight Edwards and D line linebackers have just been shutting him down right at the point of attack. Twelve rush, eight pass. It's been a little more rush heavy from Atlanta. Here is Hudson looking on the screen. No one's there. He had a man open, but he missed the throw, and that was Hudson's fault there. And it's third down and thirteen. They don't want to get Atlanta another chance. I mean, Phoenix another chance to score. But Atlanta's got to do something here on third down. They've not been good at all tonight. So third and thirteen from Atlanta. Eric Shady's in the slot. Look out for him. And to run, Warren Rocker, and I don't know why they're doing that. They need to make something happen. And now it's fourth and nine. That's not your play call by Atlanta right there. I would have definitely thrown that. And the punt's going to be away. This one going down to the take 24. And that's where it's taken it in. He's going to be dropped at the 34. First and ten. Nice little juke move by Jokes. He's in a 
get hit down at a first down. Second and one. Here's second and one. Taps throwing this one. Taking in. He plows through the defenders, but taking out of bounds. He wouldn't stand his feet if it wasn't out of bounds. Sam Hart, the rookie. That's six yards on that pickup. Here's first and ten. Taps launching this one. In traffic, no. Not complete. Looking deep on that one, but Taps got to get complete. I think that's what Hudson's got to take a note on. Taps is th throwing a couple shots, and I think Hudson's got to do the same thing. Here's second down, Taps. Rowing complete and out of bounds. Forty six seconds left at the forty nine. The Yale Monsters want another score. They're fifteen rush, fifteen pass. Here's third down. Steps stepping up. Teps is gonna take off. Tackled before he gets the first down. Marino and Wettis on that tackle, and it's going to be a fourth down for Phoenix. Steps trying to pick that one up with his legs. Usually he's capable of it, but this time Atlanta gets there. Thought he had an open lane, but he had to juke on Marino, but he's a pretty good open field tackler. He gets it on that play. Fourth and two as Atlanta will try, I mean, Phoenix will try the long field goal. This one, a 60-yarder, wow. They're going to drown out this clock to the final second. Kick up. It's not making it. No good, and that will bring us to the end of the first half of play. So after one half, it's Atlanta Predators 3, Phoenix Seal Monsters 20 on the Thursday night football game. And it's been a good one, as the defending champs fight on the new franchise. As you can see, Phoenix has led in most of the categories. As Sam Hart, the rookie, got their touchdown, and Hank Whoop had the receiving touchdown. But Atlanta, they just gotta throw through a little more, because the run game has not been working against Phoenix. You can try it a few more times, but unless it doesn't get cooking, in, at least in the first, first two drives of this half, I'd say you gotta throw up, throw, start throwing it with um, Hudson. Give him some chances out there. Let your rookie shine. And the kick away, Phoenix will start us off in the second half. Taken out from the end zone. Now we'll turn this one all the way up to the 26. Julio jokes 33 yards per turn. He's great tonight. Franklin might have to take a few pointers. First and ten. Here is Taps. Jokes gets the carry. Goes right through the defense, and that one taken for two yards. Matthew Harvin, his first tackle of the season.
Second and eight. Here is Taps. Taps stepping up for this time. Taps gonna make a first. Taps moving all the way to the 50 yard line. Oh no, 49 are gonna call. Taps is, he has four rushes, 39 yards. Josh Carl's on the tackle that time. Hudson, a little frustration there on the sideline. Here's a carry. Stretches one to the outside. Hit the 49. That's where the line of scrimmage is. And he's dropped there. Second 11. Andy Sandal on that tackle. Second and 11. Taps going to hand us off to Jokes. Oh no, Sam Hart actually. Sam Hart, his third carry, is going to go for two yards. Third down and eight. Peyton Wettis a tackle, his first of the season. Third down and eight for Phoenix. Atlanta needs to stop pretty badly. It's third and eight. Screen not going to work. He had pressure in his face. That was applied by Payne Wettis, and it's fourth down. Phoenix will have to punt now. We'll see what Atlanta does on their first drive in the second half. See if Phoenix can pin them deep or how good the punter is. This one, they're going to mark out at the 17. Hudson on his first drive of the second half. We'll see how they do. His first and ten. Hudson throwing this one caught. Eric Shady to the twenty-two. That's five yards. Picks up a second and four. That was a nice pass, and that's what I want to see. I want to see Hudson more in the air game. I've seen a lot of Rocker, but that's gone not really far. If you're using Rocker, at least try to stretch him outside. Eric Shady, his second catch is 12 yards now. Second and four. Here's a carry. Rocker. Rocker finally finding room. For the 34, he's 10 carries, 12 yards. It's not been a good day for him. A good night for him, I should say. But hopefully he's trying to change that in the second half. Here is first and ten. Here's Rocker outside. Rocker finding room gets it to the 41. That's the place I'd like to see. That's what's going to get him going. Second and three now. Jordan Jackson on the tackle. And Atlanta finally starting to get a little bit of a wheel turning here. Second and three. Hudson. And then off to Rocker. Rocker gonna get stopped at the 43. Two yards. And it's third down and one. Julio Odom on the tackle. Third and one. Atlanta needs a conversion here pretty bad to get back in this game. Hudson, play action. Gives it to the back. Did he get there? I think that was William Huffman. Fourth and inches, no. Yeah, William Huffman with the catch, and you can't expand. Fourth and inches. Byron Baxter. With the tackle. Nine 
William Huffman. Ah, all he needed to do was one more inch, and that would have been good. I think Atlanta's gonna go for this, but they're not going. To. Nope, they're not going to. Of course. Fourth and inches. A punt from the thirty. Let's see how far this one's gonna go. Gonna be in the end zone. A touchback. So we'll take it at the twenty yard line. That's going to come back out here. He's 9 for 16 tonight. 117 yards, a touchdown, and zero interceptions. Pretty good so far from Tets. And he's hoping to lead us to the victory here with a few more first downs and a field goal. He'll probably do it. Here's Jokes first down. Jokes moving around. Gets it to the 26. Second and four. Second and four, bottled up at the 23. Third and seven. Second tackle for loss for Dan Marino. And then Atlanta needs one more stop to go back to the offense. Third down and seven. Steps. Rolling, that's complete. First down. Off the quick slant in that one. Gets into the hands of Esteban Silvestri. His first catch of his career. He goes for 10 yards for the rookie. First and ten. Steps up to the line. He's going to take this one to Jokes. Jokes working his way through the pile. He gets to the 38 after a nice run. Second and five. Atlanta needs to get a stop here. They don't want too much time to get off that clock. There's been 23 rush, 17 pass. They've been a little too rushing. But you got to get... Some clock off that time. Here's Jokes finding some room on the outside. He gets stopped at the 47. Julio Jokes finally getting the chains moving a little bit. As Adam Carson's first tackle of the season. Him and Toby Trent were on that tackle. So here's first down and 10. 47. Taps. Taps stepping up. Hit. That's a fumble. It's grabbed by Peyton Lettuce. And the Predators have the ball. Each QB is fumbled now. And just like that, the Predators have the ball. Popped out of there, but I don't even know who, but... They play end zone has the tackle on him and I think that was Josh Carls with the force fumble. The so rocker, he's had nine carries zero yards in the first half. This half three carries twenty one yards, so he's been better this half, but we'll see how he continues to play. So let's see if Hudson can make a comeback. Rocker first down. Gets it to the 43. Second and five. Here's Rocker again. Rocker stopped at the line. Third and six now. Second tackle for loss for Jordan Jackson. 
I'm going to clip roaster all over that one. They're down six. Here's Hudson. Hudson searching. Hudson escaping pressure. Hudson first down a lot more. Don't fumble. Ugh. Doesn't fumble and he gets into the 30 yard line. He has four rushes, 86 yards. 27 yard run. Three runs for over 20 plus yards for Hudson. Carlos Young on the tackle. A great run there from Hudson. And we'll be back in just a few moments here in Phoenix. We're back in Phoenix. Uh, it's first and ten for Atlanta at the 30. 109 left to go in the third quarter. In the home opener for Phoenix, in the home opener, or the season opener for this season. First and ten. Hudson. Rowing. Intercepted. And that will probably do it. He's still going. Byron Baxter. He had seven last year. He's his first this year. Picks it off. Hudson, the rookie. And that's one Hudson will remember. Number one in his career. As now Phoenix has it, with a little over 11 minutes left to go, or a little less than 11 minutes to go in the game, and they have a lead of 17. That one stings. They were in striking distance, and he had to throw the pick. And at the 26, Phoenix will start this drive. See what Teps can do. Here's a carry by Jokes. Jokes finding room. Jokes to the 42. 18 carries, 91 yards for Julio Jokes. That was just 5 yards to carry. Nothing with Harmon with the tackle. First and ten, here's the run, Jokes. Jokes, it's a missed tackle. Jokes to the 42 on the other side now, and he has 19 carries, 107 yards. And that's the end of the third quarter. Nothing scored in that quarter, it's 20-3, to three with one more quarter left to play. And a Phoenix. Here it is, the handoff. To Jokes. Jokes gonna make it back to the line of scrimmage. His 20th carry now. Carl's his fourth tackle. And it's second and ten. Hand off to Jokes. Jokes! Tries to make a man miss, but he ain't gonna get far. Third and nine. And off jokes. Jokes gets it to the thirty eight. Fourth and seven. Yeah. 
This one, 55 yards. Pick up and good. It makes it. And it's 3 to 23, just like that. And the Gila Monsters spread their lead to 20. And the kickoff away as Atlanta will get back. Taken out from the 20. I mean, the end zone until it gets to the 20. Here's first and ten. Hudson. Throwing the slant. That's hit. Joseph Carousel still on his feet to the 26, and he's injured. He's down. And that's an early injury, and that's going to impact the Predators receiving for quite a bit. Carousel's down. His first catch, and he's already down. New second and four. Hudson. Feel pressure is going down. Tony Amigo. His first sack of the season. And just like that, Hudson experiences his first sack. He's third and 13. Hudson. Throwing. There's a flag on the play. It intercepted. Bounced off the hands of Shady. He's going to take this one to the 15. Holding on Israel Kubert, and that's going to be declined. So, that's a second interception throw. Not his fault, technically, but. Here's Teps on first and ten. So Teps. Rowing, that's caught. Little move there. And he gets it to the twelve. That one was Esteban Sylvester, it's his second catch. Second and six. Here is Julio Jokes. Jokes takes off a tackle. Gets it to the seven. Seven minutes up to go, by the way, in this game. Here's third down. Third down and two. Peps. Peps trying to get away, and he gets a sack. Dan Marino. His first sack of the season. And he tracks down Peps for a sack.
Here's fourth and six. Kick up. It's good. And it's 23 point game just like that. We'll be back in L Phoenix in just one second. We're back in Phoenix. Five good deal left to go in this game. The old monsters are winning by 23. Here's first and ten, Hudson. Feeling pressure against this one away. Rocker holds on. Wow. That was a great keeper by Rocker. Your second and three. Hudson, gonna take off this pass amigo, gonna get this one to the 39. Seven yards away from having a 100 yard rush game. Here's first and ten. Uh, I mean, Hudson throwing. Caught on the screen by Rocker. Get this one to the 42. Here's first and second and seven, I mean. Hudson scrambling. Hudson to the 45. Six carries and 96 yards. Here's third down to four. Hudson. Throwing. That's right in the hands. And to the 46, they go. First reception for space. Urban space. First and ten. Here's Hudson. Rowing another screen. Rocker can't get anyone on this one, though. Second and thirteen. Tackle there by Gordon Jackson. So here is second and thirteen, Hudson. Rowing gets that one to the forty. Never cancer on that catch. Check four. 
Here's one more. Hudson. Boeing, complete rocker, another scream. Why are they doing so many screams? They're not working. And it's fourth and six. So the punt's gonna be away and it's gonna be taken to the 20. First and 10. Taps. This is off to jokes, jokes to the 26. 24 carries, 123 yards. Two minute warning. It's 326 here in Phoenix on Thursday Night Football. And the Predators are losing by 23. Your second and three. Taps to jokes. Jokes. First down. To the 36. Ten yards in that carry. First and ten. Dragons one down. Steps rowing complete. Let's check wood. Second and four. He's four catches, forty seven yards on the deck. Second and four. Carry by jokes. Making it to the 45. That one will do us. 326, your final score here in Jackson. I mean, in Phoenix, my bad. The game we got to see here tonight. And let's we'll see a lot more good ones on Sunday. That's the game. 326, the Gill Monsters start their season with a win, and the new team, Predators, start off with a loss. Steps, great game. We'll see how he does in the MVP race for next week, and we'll see if he is in the MVP race. Assuming he will be. A great game we got to see here tonight. And we'll see what I can see on Sunday. Because I can't wait for that. And I'll see you then. As for now, I am your commentator, Joshua Hexel. And we'll see you on the Sunday at 1 p.m. When we'll see the two games, which will be the Kansas City win hosting the Cleveland Pirates. And the other one would be Houston. Oh, no, my bad. It would be New York going to New Orleans. So stay tuned for those games. I'm Joshua Hexel. See you Sunday.